of the Christmas vlogs that come out, you guys, they're going to be my favorites. I can already tell. I've never done Christmas vlogs with you. I didn't even do a lot of Christmas content last year. I think last year I only did one video that was for like what to buy for like teacher's gifts and that. So we got Christmas content this year. I'm really excited. But I wanna go ahead and first unbox everything. Here's the plan. This is what I'm thinking. I'm thinking we're gonna go through and empty everything out. There's a ton of new stuff that we got here. So I want to separate with like Christmas, um, that's all Christmas decor. I wanna separate that is like tiered trade stuff, little decorating things, things for the tree to decorate, picks and sticks. I wanna empty everything out, lay everything out. I have this nice big space up here and I wanna sort it all out. And I think we're gonna start decorating. I am in the Christmas spirit, you guys. I'm gonna link this sweatshirt down below if it's still available. It's from Sam's Club and it was like $13. I went oversized and it's so cute, right? It says Mary on it, I don't know. Let's get unpacking though. I'm excited. Let's start the dis or let's start the Christmas content. I'm so used to the Disney content. Let's start the Christmas content. Um, if there's any specific videos you guys want to see, go ahead and drop them down below. I would greatly appreciate it. But yeah, let's go start unboxing. Okay, one little pro tip for you guys. Like at the end of the year, like or at the end of the season, or like the beginning of like another season. Like this stuff, I think I bought from Pottery Barn in like July and it wasn't even like a Christmas in July sale or anything like that. I just always look at like the clearance stuff and they usually have really good stuff and then they pretty much have the same stuff come up for the next year. So that's what this was. I think I ordered this a year or two ago because I didn't do a ton of decorating last year. Um, so this year I wanna get everything out. But yeah, oh see, yes! Look at how cute this is. And this is like still so on trend, but this was Pottery Barn and I'm pretty sure I bought this for like $5. So this will be really cute like setting up in like the tiered tray or just having little baked goods. Um, also, I know a way to make this into a tiered tray. So if you want like some craft videos, like some DIY videos, let me know and I can do some because this would actually be a really, really, really cute like mini cake stand or tiered tray and I have like the easiest way of doing things. So let me know in the comments down below, even on Instagram, if that's something you wanna do. But yeah, I find this stuff for like dirty cheap. Like, it doesn't say how much it was or anything. I'm I'm like almost positive it was like $5 less. Dishwasher safe, Pottery Barn, love it. Okay, I know this looks like a lot, but it's not all of it. <laughs> okay, so what I have still packed up in these two totes, I'm gonna switch that one over. When I'm done, like taking everything down, it's going to be one of these instead of one of these. This one has all of my outdoor stuff in it, and this is like strictly tree decorations. It's like picks and stuff like that, and that's actually for the tree up here. So what I did is I kind of separated my garlands or my wreaths that I decorate with inside. All of this is strictly inside. And then at, this is more of like railing, I would say. And then this, I like putting a lid out here because I can literally pick up the lid and just take it downstairs or wherever I need to be. But this is all like little tchotchke, little decorating, tear tray, tear tray, which I have a lot of my tear tray stuff downstairs already. Um, little picks and stuff I have in here, which they're just piled in there. I was running out of space. And I honestly, I don't like these. I just, I thought they were going to be more like whimsical and elfy. I think they might be better once I get them in the actual tree, but we'll see. I, I'm not really feeling them. They were like Walmart, like a couple dollars. I will go ahead and link them down below. And then this is Village, which Village might be up here this year. I don't know because I have like a whole gingerbread village that I need to show you guys. Um, and then this is all little snow globes, Santa's little mailbox, little dangly like guys, little little like appetizer plates um really important like these right here are really important decorations to me my dear friends um actually maybe this and it lights up this my grandparents made when i was a kid and then that is my grandparents first 
Christmas card, I believe, that they did it. And that is in my grandma's frame. So I have not touched that. I don't open it up, but that comes out every Christmas for me. And then any little kid stuff I have in there. I have more kids. Um ornaments are more in here this is a whole ornament bin i have them separated by like non-important ornaments to disney ornaments to like kid made ornaments and then big ornaments and then ribbons all through here we have like christmas trees you guys saw me like ghoul over those or like get all excited over those this is all home stuff so this is bathroom it's like a dining table throw um another throw blanket a big candle this is pillow covers wooden signs this is all right this whole big pile right here is all stockings these are right here and all this like really fuzzy stuff and then there's uh, this colored tree skirt along with this tree skirt i got all of that at Nordstrom rack on clearance last year this is my elves that you guys saw i got and then any kind of wrapping paper this is strictly kitty stuff that they get um, and then I have Snow Village stuff over here. But yeah, you guys can kind of see. Oh, and then back behind me are like little prop stuffed animals like my gnomes. Um, I have a little gingerbread something right there. You guys saw on my Walmart one. I got a Santa. I got a Bath and Body Works candle holder. I got Mickey and Mickey Snow Globe. Trees that light up. Cords. You can kind of see I kind of got it all like sectioned so what i'm gonna do now is i think i'm gonna go maybe tweak downstairs a little bit um and maybe start pre-setting up my tier tray let's go see what we can do we have like a little over an hour left to like go pick up the kids so let's go see what we can all get done okay so this is kind of what i'm starting off with i'm gonna do my tier tray that just seems like the easiest to me i mean it's the most work and i honestly don't even know if i have all the stuff i have to bring a bunch of more stuff downstairs or from upstairs to downstairs but i want to show you this was a lot of what you guys saw in that hall um, I've put candies in here i've put nuts in here because the m&ms were becoming a problem the elf i love him i got this at target our countdown which that is needing to be updated we are actually less than that uh he was ten dollars at walmart he is a must um, love this those were those little sprinkles best tip i can give you is that when you're doing a tier tray like this like a build your own tier tray it's gonna be easier to just go ahead and lay something like this on top of here and kind of do it like like your own level and then what i do since they're all different colors and that i kind of fill this with that like batting snow and then it gives it white and i did a non-themed ones because i have different holidays that i like to decorate for on my island so this is really easy so i'm going to fill this up with snow but before i do that i'm going to probably use some like things like this as like risers so let's say like i want something to sit a little higher it's going to get covered by snow but then this will sit higher on here. Or if I want something like this to be even higher, I can get something like these. Like I got these on um, like the, the dollar section at like, or the bullseye section at Target. And I could go ahead and see how they just have like the three legs. I could go ahead and do something like that in here or a much smaller one and add it in here. Like if I had a little candle that needed to sit by this guy, that's something super easy. smiles and the wishes and I want it all from the lights to the mistletoe tell me one thing is there anything that you're missing I will keep you warm as soon as you remove that snow whatever we do all right, these holiday wonders will open your mind. May all your wishes tonight come true. The love I live, the dream I knew. This Christmas, I only wanna be close to you.
So I think this is what we're gonna go with. I'm gonna go ahead and take a picture because now I need to deconstruct to put in all of like the like the batting and everything, like the snow. And then what I'm gonna do is put fairy lights and then sprinkle these balls kind of all over. So let's go ahead and do that next. Whatever we do, we will be all right. These holiday wonders will open your mind. May all your wishes tonight come true. The love I live, the dream I knew. Well, I'm off for Christmas. It's a magical time full of kisses. Take a walk outside and tickle the snowman's nose. Moving nimbly, did you hear something from the chimney? I will keep you warm as soon as you remove that snow. You guys, I am so happy with the way that this turned out. It is so cute. A lot of these things I've had over the years, like these little twisties, these are little clips that go onto the tree. They're great little fillers. And yes, I did do some hidden Mickeys in there for my kids. They'll be loving on that. It's so much fun to do. Um, and I wanted to show you guys like these, like they're not moving. They're all not moving. You can put little hidden things in there for your kids to find, or you can seal that closed. This one, I put my cake cups in here, which I need to refill. Um, but yeah, again, he was $10 at Walmart, so I'll go ahead and link him. Um, but a lot of the stuff I had, a lot of the stuff I got at, you know, um, Michael's, this I've gotten at like TJ Maxx years ago. These are really cute. Um, and it's the same one as these. They're really, really fun. And I just have them sitting here so they can be moved. Their legs move, their arms move. Um, I kind of like one down and one kind of up. This is the countdown. It's not until Christmas, it's actually until our next trip. I do have about three rounds of these fairy lights. I'm gonna show you guys and I'll link them down below. They're extremely inexpensive. They have battery operated and they come with extra batteries. They're not that long, but they they do really good. You get a lot of bang for your buck. I did put some ornaments on here. I did get the wrong snow. This is the snow that you can't fluff up fluff up as easy um so you can see that it's a little bit more layered but i'm okay with it i did some lights all the way around i wanted to always be presentable all the way around i wish i had a little bit more to fill in here but i was kind of struggling to find some things um even this ornament i did kind of put it down i put some of that museum wax on there um i didn't enclose this because i'll maybe hide some little goodies in there for my kids to find I ran out of goof off or goo gone or whatever you guys call it. Um, I ran out, so some of these have tags, but I'll easily be able to get to them. I went ahead and topped off Santa here. Dropped one of the balls. I dropped off Santa with some cashews, and then this was that ornament. It's a rubber spatula, but I just kind of thought that was cute sitting in there. But yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, do me a favor and hit that thumbs up button. I would greatly appreciate it. If you want more videos like this to come, and yes, I still have a mess of all the things. Like, I'm not hiding here. Um, oh, I do want to go ahead and get a couple more of these sticks. Um, sticks or stems, whichever you call them. To fill this out a little bit more. I did put a trash bag in there to help fill it and make it not move as much. Make it the way I want to say it. But I think I'm going to get another one of these little light picks and shove that in there and fill it out a little bit more. But yeah, the hidden Mickeys are real, you guys. If you enjoyed this video, do me a favor and give it this video a big thumbs up if you're new here. I welcome you. I'm excited to be bringing you more Christmas content, any luxury, lifestyle, mom life, anything in between, decorating, um, all real things are gonna be here on this channel. So don't forget to hit that subscribe, turn that notification bell, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.